All right. Hey, welcome everybody. Scotty Scanlon here, Kansas City. Uh, this is our Monday night leadership show. And uh, man, I am super excited tonight. Uh, we've got a great guest on with us this evening that is going to be rolling out to everyone uh, really something that uh, I've decided myself personally uh, that I'm going to run with with my organization, with any new associates I'm bringing on board. Uh, David and Liz LeCue are out of the state of California. Um, I've been working with these two for quite a long time. Uh, I actually served with them as network vice presidents uh, honorably over the last uh, year, which has been honestly probably one of the best leadership experiences of my life. It's been such a great team of people to be involved with, 16 very effective network vice presidents that have done a tremendous job. And I get to sit in a lot of meetings. Um, David is always making a contribution uh, to everything that we do. And uh, we've been spending a little bit of time together because I'm speaking with Liz on, so we we're co-partners, presenters at the convention. So she's gonna be in California, I'm gonna be at the convention and you'll see how that works. It'll be kind of interesting and a lot of fun. But, uh, but we've been working together, and so he's been listening to some of our, our rehearsals, and then we really got into a big conversation about something they brought up a week earlier, uh, which I had actually downloaded these scripts and these PDFs and a quick, uh, very short PDF kind of flipbook type presentation that's very effective, and I actually did it today, and I'll let D David allude to that here in a little bit, and maybe I'll answer a little bit on that. But uh, here's what I do know, and this, and he'll probably reiterate this, but I do know this, that they've been doing this for a little over a month. Last month, they had a 70% increase in production and a 40% increase in recruiting across the board. And they even let me see their back office. And I saw the premium numbers myself personally, and I'm pretty good at adding up the numbers and figuring out what the check might look like on that. So I was like, whoa, wait a minute, man. Uh, we're doing something. We got to make, I, there's an adjustment somewhere. This is the adjustment. I've been looking for this adjustment for a while. Uh, I know some other guys, you guys have shared it with David also will have a lot of success with this. Um, so I'm going to flip it out to you to just run with it, man. Bring us uh, to where our conversation has gone. If you need me, I'll interject and uh, I'll send it out. Guys, Dave LeCue from California, $200,000 ringers, guys. These guys are rocking. David, out to you. Thank you so much, Mr. Scantlin. And it has always been fun and such a great time working this business and seeing you at all the conventions and, and uh, working together at NVP. Uh, and, and thank you for your great leadership. This is a fantastic group. Thank you for having me. Just so you know, my background, 17 years in tech sales, made a lot of money doing that. Never thought I'd run a business like Legal Shield, but my wife, Liz, when I met her on our second date, we went to a Legal Shield briefing, frankly, and I realized, wow, <laughs> okay, this, this chick is serious about this thing. I better sign up right away or the relationship is going nowhere. <laughs> That's what I said to myself in my head. I didn't say it there. I signed up right away, but I did see the value in all sincerity. And um, and I basically have been very supportive all these years, but it wasn't until a few years ago where I get tired in corporate America being passed over for promotions and jumping from jump company to company as new management would be brought on and wipe us out or, you know, they'd go in and out of business in the tech field. And so I dove into the business with her a few years ago, and that is when I finally had a chance to build my own business. And we doubled the income over the last couple of years to $200,000. We're very privileged to be Millionaire Club members. And um, and the rest is history there. Liz has been doing this business 16 years, and I guess I've been all in about three years now. So I walked away from the tech career. So um, that's a little bit about us. Let's dive into, so I got 10 minutes or so. How much time do I got here, Scott? 10, 15 minutes? As long as you need, uh, 10, okay. 15 minutes, however long you want to go, man. It's on go you. Fast. Okay. Yep. Just perfect. Perfect. So this is um, just recently, there were some, uh, we saw as far as getting people started right, we want, we've been good at recruiting in our team, but I got to be honest with me and Liz, we would say we're, we're lousy at sponsoring new people because Traditionally, we thought this percentage of people that actually get active and fast start qualify was like one out of 10, two out of 10 or something like that. OK, and, and roughly around there. And we just figured that's the way it was. But we're like, man, we got to be able to improve that number. How do we help people get started and make it easier, simpler and safer? 
How do we make it simpler and safer for a new person to get started to where their anxiety is lowered and we make it super simple that they can do. And we came up with, this is nothing new. This is, we said, let's start going to their top three, just their top three that we do two-on-one presentations with. Two-on-one, because now I'm in control of the process. And we invented, a, we invented, we came up with a very simple script, which I'm going to show to you in just a second, that allows that new person just to book a presentation two-on-one with one of their top three closest people in their lives, most supportive people. And there's some amazing things that happen there. What we found is if they send out this script, and I'll show it to you in a second, that there's almost 100%, when they let us do it, there's 100% of the time that they book a meeting, their first two-on-one presentation, 100%, because they're approaching the most loving, supportive person in their life. The second thing we found is that 100% of the time that person shows up, that's a pretty big deal because they are the most loving, supportive person. And if they're not there, we call them and get right on. The third thing we found out is that it always went, this person was always in their best behavior because we're there and it was a positive experience. The person's feedback is always, oh, this is great, fantastic. And so we finally created something to where all that new person has to do is use the script to invite they're one of their top three most supportive people as a practice, a practice two-on-one presentation where we're going to do a training. And you'll see the script in a second, see why it works. And then they show up and we do that two-on-one presentation. And we're finding that 100% of the time, up to this point, 100% of the time, somebody, if they let us do those three presentations to their top three people, two-on-one, guess what? They all have gotten a sale. And we've actually had, um, we've had t- in, in one leg, Kathy Montoya on our team went, uh, she did executive director production last last month for the first time, uh, some technicalities that she didn't hit ED. But what she found was, is that her team duplicated rapidly. We had a good um, six or seven people, fast start qualify out of like 10 people that she brought on. And we'd never seen that many fast art qualified before, such a high percentage doing this, okay? And so let me dive in and show you what this script is and how it works. I, and then um, maybe that'll answer a lot of your questions. So let me share my screen. So that's a little bit about why. Okay, so you guys, what we do on a game plan now is on a welcome call or a game plan, I just ask the person if they got a few minutes, I want to show them what our system is. Do you have a few minutes to show? And they're like, sure, I got a few minutes. And I'll dive in and just ask them what their why is. So that's the first thing I'm doing on a game plan. And this is part of, part of the game plan is the simplicity of it. What's their why? Why are you doing this business? That's the first thing, right? We all know that. But then we just open up this five-step exposure process. And I'll text them the link and they'll open it up right on their phone. Or if I'm in a Zoom, I'll share it with them. And this is what it is. I walk them through. Look, all we do in this business is these five things. When somebody, when we're sharing this with someone, we share. We share that you're in business and that you want to show it to them. That's what you're going to do with your people. The next thing is you're going to use a tool. You're going to use a tool, not your mouth. Schedule time to show them Legal Shield with your trainer or invite them to your private Zoom call or send them a video. And then the third thing we do is a three-way call. Get your prospect on the phone with someone in Legal Shield who can share their testimonial and answer your prospects questions. And then four, a live event. After that, we're gonna invite them to a live event, a live Legal Shield open house where they need to see it to believe it. They'll see the bigger picture. And if they're not quite ready to get started after that, regardless, we're gonna drip on them. We're gonna drip on them with testimonial videos, profiles of success, news articles, events, and other tools until they're ready to sign up, okay? So I'll ask the person, so any questions there? Does that process make sense? I'm like, no, I get it. Okay, that's the process we're walking through, great. So now what we're gonna do, that was the second thing we showed. The third thing now is we're just gonna focus, these are some scripts that you can use to build your business. We're gonna focus, focus on this first one today. That's all we're gonna do is focus on this hot market script. And I'm gonna show you how it can help you book some meetings here and get you paid and promoted, very simple and easier. So what we wanna do is our goal is to meet meet two-on-one for a private Zoom with your hot market. That's why it says hot market script. And who's that? That's gonna be your most loving, supportive people in your life, your mother, brother, sister, best friend one, best friend two, right? 
the people, aunts, uncles, um, maybe a coworker, somebody that you know that's very close to you and is supportive, they would do you a favor. They would have your back. They're a positive, open-minded person. That's who we want to meet with because all we're going to do is practice with them because what we want for you, Mr. New Recruit, is want to have a low stress, fun environment where there's not a lot of pressure. The pressure is not there. We're not going to try to sign them up. We're just going to share, but you're going to get to watch us train and present. And when you do that, you're going to learn 70, 80% of what you need to know in this business. You will learn by inviting somebody to a presentation and watching us do that presentation and interact with your customer and answer their questions and interact with you. Does that make sense? Okay, so it's gonna be a practice. So this is how the script goes. I wanna ask you for help and you can text this or call. So I wanna ask for your help. I'm in training with my new company and I need to watch my trainer share our services with three people this week on a quick 15 minute Zoom. You may or may not be interested in our services and that's okay, but you'd really be helping me by letting me do this. Do you have 15 minutes free today or tomorrow to help me? Is morning or afternoon better? And that's all you got to do. So, hey, would you feel comfortable, Mr. Associate, a new associate? Would you feel comfortable? Read that back to me right now. Let me hear you read it. Is that okay? Okay, great. They read it back to me. Perfect. Now, pretend I'm your... Now, let me give me an example. Who would be the most loving, supportive person in life? They would just let you practice with them and be supportive. Who would that person be? Oh, my mother. Great. So why don't we want to pretend right now, pretend I'm your mother and read this and just pretend you're inviting me to this event, this quick 15 minute Zoom. OK, you ready to read it? Great. They read it to me. OK, you're set. So you feel comfortable inviting your mom? Great. Now, perfect. That is a great first step. Now, are there two more people that would be supportive, maybe a best friend that you might share this with? OK, got a best friend. Great. Can you do that with them as well? Now, would you call or text them? Oh, you would text them. So why don't you just send this in a text then? And who would be that third person? Oh, your, your uncle, Bob, great, okay. Would you call or text Bob? You would call him, great. So you feel comfortable calling him and saying that same script? Okay, now listen, when you call somebody, here's a person, you guys write this down. Now, if somebody asks you what's this about or explain more, just go back to any line in this script and repeat it and it works. This is very similar to the Dave Savula method and you'll see. So somebody asks, well, hey, what's this about? Tell me about the company, you go, well, Look, I just need to watch my trainer share our services with three people this week, okay? And it's only going to be 15 minutes. So what would you do? Would, uh, do you have 15 minutes today or tomorrow? Which would be better? Or, hey, can't you explain this? Tell me more about it. What is it? Well, look, you may or may not be interested in our services, and that's okay. But you'd really be helping me by letting me do this. So do you have 15 minutes free today or tomorrow to help me? You see? You just reuse it that way. It's just like the Dave Savula script that we all know and love. So that is the hot market script. And guys, when somebody will share that with the top three, we have had successfully booked three Zooms for them. And invariably, they always get at least a membership. And we've had, instead of the two out of 10, we've had more like six out of 10 that have fast start qualified, which is incredible. Okay. In fact, uh, somebody I did this with, a guy named AC, I tried to convince him not to do this business. I'm like, AC, you don't want to do this because he's not somebody that you would describe as Anyways, for a lot of reasons, I'm like, I don't know if you want to do this, man. And he's like, no, I want to do it. And I didn't think he could do this, but I said, hey, can you text the script? He texted this out to three people and all three people showed up. I did presentations and all three people said, this is amazing. I want to get started. And then all of a sudden he knew more than three people. He knew a hundred more people and he sent out an invite to like 20, 30 more people. And we did a private a grand opening the, a few days later. OK, so this is just an intermediate step between this and a, a Zoom launch and, you know, where you invite multiple people. But this is a safe place where it's fun. You're answering questions. And here, here's here's why this works. OK, and I'm going to show you the presentation. Just one second. So stay with me here. I have a bunch of reasons why we believe this works so well. First of all, we're taking their fear and their anxiety down because what's people's greatest fear? It ranks, anybody know what's the greatest fear for most people? It's higher than dying, like people's greatest fear. Does anyone know what that is? Talk, speaking in front of an audience. That's right, speaking in front of an audience. And what do we do if we wanna jump them right into a group presentation where they're gonna introduce us and share why they started the business? They're speaking in front of an audience, aren't they? The worst part is that they're the most they're, they're their closest contacts friends. So they're also opening themselves up for what? Rejection. And guess what ranks right there with death? Maybe slightly above, I'm not quite sure. Rejection from people that we know ranks right up there with 
speaking in front of people and dying. So we wanted to lower those things. And by having them invite somebody they know, no matter what, wouldn't reject them. And by having it be one-on-one -on -one where we're in control of the process and the whole conversation, we remove those anxieties and people have showed up and done it. So that's the first positive, I think. The other things that we believe is that it's a positive experience. You get positive feedback because they're on their prospect. The person you're showing it to is on their best behavior because you're there. Because I'm there, they can't blast their 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 friend or their uh, you know their mother, brother, sister, right? In fact, I've had people go. They even bring it up. Well, hey, I'm interested in the um, I'm interested in the membership, but I don't want to do the pyramid. I don't want to do the pyramid thing. And I'm like, because I'm there with my associate. I realized if they were by themselves, they would get blasted by their brother saying, yeah, this is a pyramid thing, right? But because I'm there, they just kind of sloughed it off. And then I sloughed it off. I'm like, okay, no problem. Let's talk about that membership. And we signed them up for membership right there. And the associate was ecstatic. So think about that. Without me, gets blasted by the pyramid conversation. With me, we sell a membership. Wow, that's a big difference, right? Big difference. Okay, so it's no stress. There's no rejection. And people love to connect. This is where the premise is, is you guys have all known before all this technology, we used to do sit downs with people one-to-one -one or two-on-one -on -one with our sponsor. And we present to somebody and learn to do a presentation. And what's powerful about that is we connect and people get to talk. When my prospect is talking, they're buying. When I'm talking, they're just being talked at. They're not necessarily in buying mode. But when they start asking questions, start talking about how they can see themselves using it, they are buying. Trust me, 17 years of tech sales. That's the number one rule. You want them talking, not me. So what's great is we, um, we get them on their best behavior. The people get a chance to talk and talk themselves in the sale. And we get to address and sell to their needs. And we're in control of the whole process. And here's the best part. I think this is the best part. This is way simpler and easier a process for a new person to, cut, to understand because if you look at it, when we do a two-on-one presentation, steps one through four happen at once. This is a big key. I believe a new person's mind, and my mind for that matter, can understand the idea of inviting somebody to an appointment. But when I tell them I'm going to walk them through this exposure process, okay, let's get you going. We want to reach out to 20 people and we want you to text all 20 people a video. That's great. But now they've got to follow up. They got to follow up. Nobody picks up. Then they got to text and follow. Then they got to follow up again, get somebody on the phone and find out they didn't watch the video. And then after you finally found out that they watched the video, then they got to get somebody on a three-way call, which may or may not go well. And then they got to invite them to a live event and the person doesn't show up to a live event. And then finally get the person on the live event. And then we got to try and get them on a three-way call, three call after the live event to close them. And it turns into this multi-step process. And the, the average person that doesn't have a massive amount of sales experience can't even comprehend that. That's just my personal belief. Scott, am I way off there? Am I like... No, I think I think you're dead on. I think you're totally right. And that, I think, is the brilliance Whoa. of what you guys have figured out with this entire thing. Let's just... Now, all they got to do is invite one person. Their brain goes, and I'll ask, so who do you know? Now, we know they know hundreds of people, but there'll be like a long pause, and I'll just wait and like, well, I guess my sister's supportive, and they'll invite them. I'm like, can you text your sister? Yes, that's all you got to do, and they show up, and we take care of steps one through four, because what's the whole point with this business? We just want to get to a in or out as soon as possible. And in one sit down, two on one, I can get all the way to a, are you in or are you, are you out? Essentially on a scale of one to 10, how interested are you? One being not interested, 10 being sign me up right now, what would you say? And whatever they are, I can now move them to the next step. And if at that, if they go through that and they say they wanna to go to the live event and typically if they're in a, going for an associate, we'll direct them to the live event. They show up most of the time because they honestly had a chance to say no and they didn't, right? Brilliant. So it's so much simpler for a new associate to comprehend this. Okay, so there's that. You can get these scripts. Scott's going to have that in the uh, chat and show you where to get those. Now let's show you the presentation. By the way, we have Liz here. Liz, she's Hi, my Liz. lovely wife. Hey, the real deal, Liz Fulacu in the house. <laughs> oh, what is this? Just Liz Lacue. Oh, just Liz Lacue. <laughs> Hold on, I got to go back to uh, what just happened to my screen. Okay, they killed it. Um, 
So let's go to the PowerPoint presentation, okay? Now I'm gonna show you guys this presentation really quick. I'm not gonna go through the whole thing. I'm just gonna show you in a brief framework, take a minute to show you how, how I do it, the frame of, frame of attack. There you go, okay? Once again, I'm in control because I'm asking questions now. Write that down. Now I'm talking to the person and as a professional salesperson, or an upline ED that's been doing this a while, I know how to ask questions to get them sold, right? Because when you ask questions, you're really selling. So look, we protect and empower people. And you guys, on this first page, slow down and ask the questions and let them respond. I say, hey, have you ever signed a contract or document? Wait for an answer. Have you ever had a landlord or tenant issue? Wait for an answer. A presentation recently where I sold a membership where the guy said, I don't want to do the pyramid, but I want to get the membership. When I said, have you ever been charged or treated or treated unfairly? I pause and he's like, oh, um, well, yeah, yeah. I had that happen recently. I'm like, okay, ever received a traffic ticket? Pause. Yeah, yeah. I just had a couple. In fact, I got a problem with that right now. I'm like, okay, how interesting. Can you help it with pre-existing? Well, you can get advice on it. Great. Have you ever been identity theft, been a victim of identity theft? What about how to real estate transaction? And the guy's like, I paused, silence, and he's like, actually, I'm buying a house right now. This could probably help me. I hadn't even gotten to the presentation yet, and he identified two needs because I took the time. And have you ever needed to prepare a will or update your will? He's like, I haven't done a will. I probably need to update that. I got him on three things pre-sold before I start the presentation. Closing is a lot easier yeah. when you know up front what the connections are. So that's the big key. Then we just go down and we read Legal Shield established in 1972, your basic vision, and you guys know how to present that. And then we condensed the Legal Shield membership down to one page. Um, so it's not multiple slides, a lot easier to talk through. So you can talk through that, tell a few stories. And then ID Shield, we condensed down once again to one page. I mentioned we put the Forbes, hey, we were number tw number one ranked by Forbes Advisory for 2021. We put that right there. And then here's all, the, all, all of it on one slide now, okay? And then we go into the ID Shield and the member perks. There's the pricing. And we added this, add the business protection for $12.95. And you'll see here too, um, see we're down on the bottom of, this, of the slide here. It says business supplements available. Yeah. That'll prompt you to mention, by the way, this membership can be applied towards a business. And then you tie that back in down here to the fact that there's the, um, the home business supplement, which is part of the promo right now, right? Yep. And then here's the key. When we get to the business portion, we're not pulling up the fancy charts or anything, which can, we wanted to keep it more membership focused. The whole point of this is to get the person a positive experience and to find out whether the person I'm talking to would be open or interested in being an associate. I'm not looking to spell out the details of MLM structure and, and compensation plan, differential compensation plans and all of that and raise a bunch of questions. I'm looking just to find out, are they interested? Which is perfect. So um, this is all we say, hey, you get paid to tell people about a good thing. You get a direct deposit within 48 hours of between $100 and $500 every time I recommend this to somebody. So I recommend them see a presentation like this and they go to my website. Every associate gets a website, which I'll show you what, uh, what your um, Daniel's website looks like in just a second. But everyone gets a website and you can go there and enroll online. We'll get a direct deposit between 100 and $500. We get paid five days a week. We're paid daily. Isn't that great within 48 hours? The other thing that's amazing, one of the reasons I love this business is this lifetime residual. So I signed somebody up one time today and month after month, year after year, I will keep getting paid on that membership for the life of the membership. Residual income is where it's at. That's what's allowed my wife and I to have a long-term retirement plan. We have a book of business that us and this whole team we've created, uh, that, you know, and the entire team, all of those sales, we make a percentage every month and earn lifetime residuals. I'll make a six-figure income the rest of my life. And I'll adjust that, how I say that, depending on the person I'm talking to, okay? I may not say all that. And then broker agent, and this is great. We have a broker agent model, meaning you can have a broker chair with Legal Shield and bring on other agents, just like an insurance agency, just like a, um, a Keller Williams real estate agency, 
There's the brokers and they can bring on, a, bring on agents and make some override income, leveraged income from those agents and build a big business. You can build a big business here if you want to. There's people that make a full-time income just sharing the membership, making between $100 to $500 up front. But some people like myself, I've decided to build an agency. And um, now for all the agents that are on the team for every single membership sold, I'll make a, a percentage of an override off of all those sales. Just like if you owned a Keller Williams real estate agency, as the broker, you would make a commission off of every single house sold by every single real estate agent in your agency, your brokerage, okay? And so I discussed that model once again, it's a business, it's a classic business model, that's how we're set up. I'm not getting into, as you can see, I'm not getting into all the details of MLM structure. This is just very normal. It's what's in somebody's mind, the concepts are there. And then, and after that, and I'll just leave that alone, I'll go forward. And by the way, when somebody's an agent, your friend here, um, there's Performance Club and Incentive Trips. And then here's, the, um, here's some success stories we're having, okay? That's the presentation right there. And what we find, and then at the end, I'm asking two questions. You guys are probably familiar with these. I'll ask, hey, what'd you like best? Or another way I've said that lately is, um, so what stood out to you the most? Hey, I'd love to get your feet. So this is their, their, um, they're in training, right? So this person I'm talking to, I might say, hey, you know what? We'll learn a lot. Frank over here would just love, can you give us some feedback? It'd really be helpful. Maybe I can even discuss some of it with you. It'd be great for the education process. So, hey, what stood out to you the most? Or, you know, or what'd you like best? Could you share that with us? Kind of they're kind of throwing it away. And now the person will start talking, okay? And then um, when they're talking, I get a sense whether they're kind of positive or negative. Once again, they're very complimentary, even if they don't want to right now. But then I'll ask, just, hey, not sure. Just let us know. You totally may not be for you, but on a scale of one to 10, you know, what's your interest level? One being totally not interested and 10 being, wow, this is really, well, I want to support Daniel right now and get this membership. I'd love to be his first sale. Which, where would you put yourself in that spectrum? Okay. Or I'd love to, I'd love to get this membership. Where would you put yourself in that spectrum or, and they'll usually let me know, well, I'm interested in the membership and I'm not interested in the business, or I'd like to learn more about the business. I'm a nine, I'm a 10. They'll, they'll give some numbers and we'll find out right where they are. What's great is I've never had anyone say one, everyone that I do this with, they want to be supportive and loving towards the person because the way we set it up and they're on their best behavior. So they're always like, oh, five, six, seven, I, I think I could use this. And so it's a win no matter what. Even if they don't sign up right there, the associate has had a mental win. And that's huge. Okay, that's all I'll say about that. Scott, did you want to jump in here or say anything? Yeah. Hey, listen, I, I just want to, I'd love to reinforce. Um, first off, this is phenomenal. Um, I love it. I actually use uh, these slides today. I uh, got a brand new rep that's just coming on board. Um, had to run to Texas and back, but he lined up a few appointments while he was driving, which was great. His name's Keith Waters. And we jumped on uh, with a girl today. I use these slides. Uh, it was a quick, about 10 minute presentation, maybe 12 minutes tops. Uh, in and out. Um, she was very appreciative. She loved what she had to see. She had nothing but, and I did notice the thing that she was on her best behavior, you know? So, you know, it was really a really positive experience for Keith, for her. And uh, I think she's going to get on board with the services, man. I mean, she had a lot of questions. She had, she had some specific issues. I do like the fact that you spent a little bit of time going through with us and, you know, just reiterating, take your time and asking those questions. Oftentimes we're seeing a, a, a pr presentation from corporate or I'm having to do one and we fly through that because we're not talking to somebody. And I think you're right. Uh, if they're talking, they're buying. If they're not talking, they're not buying. I like that. Um, I think that's fantastic. And so I'm, I, I've had a lot of people asking me for a PowerPoint presentation that, or a flip book. Guys, this is it. I mean, that really isn't anybody. You know, Chris, you just had asked me, can I get a flip book? Uh, the other thing I like about this, Dave, Dave, is that that you know you're putting an emphasis on selling the membership, okay? And to the in in the top three, and you know here's the deal, you know we we we, we I think we do. I don't think there's anything wrong with the process of exposure, right? Especially as we get more and more engaged in the business, and we have to learn that. But when somebody's brand new, they they don't have all of that. They don't have that wiring and. You know, we don't want to overwhelm. We want to blow them out. Like if they can just easily, here's what everybody can do. And you said it, everybody can book an appointment with three people. That, that's not hard. 
We can all That's do good. that. And I think the scripting is great. And I think the PowerPoint presentation is fantastic. So that's all I got, man. I'll flip it back out to you. Um, just wanted to see if there's any other things, feedback, interest level, human mind. The main thing, you know, I've been in sales my whole life. Um, and as much as the word control is not, is kind of used or has a negative light out there, believe me, when I got this new associate started, I want control of the process and the experience big time. I want the insulator bubble around them so they can get through and do a little and have some positive experiences. At the core, at the base level here, what this enables is somebody to do something. When most associates, I get started, you know, we go through this complex thing and they don't end up doing anything or they try and they get some initial pushback because the way we're doing it and they're just, you know, they shut down. So we're finding a way to have a positive experience no matter what. And once again, if somebody allows us to do this with them, they're always having a positive experience and they're sticking around and getting to training and showing up to our first team team training like this as a result they stick around for a week or two and got you know and they're and they're all getting a sale when they you know if they do three three presentations cuz here's the thing the percentage of close on a membership goes way up when there's a referral situation scott you've sold a lot of memberships in this day and you know i don't know what the number is the percentage but when i get a referral from somebody like in networking that says hey I let this guy know that you do Legal Shield. You can call him and, and, and show him what it is. He might they have some always buy. They, always, they buy. always buy. It's like 80% or whatever it is. They always buy because it's this non involved referral situation. I think it's the same percentage here. I'm saying 80%, good chance. I'm, I'm getting a sale for this person if they'll let me do. If I get to do two presentations, two on one to their trusted people, I am for sure getting them a sale. And that's huge if everyone can get a win you keep that associate for weeks longer than you would otherwise weeks now they got a shot and that's the whole point that's the whole point well david i gotta say man you knocked it out of the park tonight we are so appreciative my entire team and organization um it's been phenomenal working with you guys i'm so thankful that you shared this with us because i i think it's breakthrough i think it's something we've been looking for and uh, so thank you so much for joining us tonight. We really appreciate you and we're glad, glad you're here with us.